number one. We have got a lot of really great things to go with. Where does number one start? Here's three. That's it? Okay, we must be at the beginning. Oh, seven and five for Mestus, and I'd love five dollars to get started. Five. Thank you. Ten. Come on, give me ten. I need ten. How about fifteen? How about twenty? Come on, twenty bucks for Saturn five. Twenty bucks. Do I hear twenty-five? Hi, Bob. Hi. <laughs> Didn't raise his hand. <laughs> twenty-five. Steve, we got twenty-five, right? No, I got twenty. Twenty. Twenty bucks. Going once. Twenty-five. Twenty-five. Thirty. Come on, thirty-five. Steve, thirty-five. You can do it. Okay, 35. Hey, we are rolling right along. Once. Twice. Sold. Steve's got it for 35. Now, you guys that were fighting over this whole thing, let's go again. Do I hear 35? 30. 25. 20. Okay, let's start at 5. Steve at five. He winked. I saw him wink. Five. Okay. Get your ten. All right, ten. Ten. Good. How about fifteen? Twenty. We got twenty. Twenty-five. Come on. Twenty-five, Roger. Twenty. Thirty. Thirty. How about thirty-five? Thirty-five. Thirty dollars. Going once. Thirty-five. Thirty-five. Look out. Okay. How about forty? Come on, forty. Yes. Just once. Okay. Thirty-five. Once. Twice. So, $35. So I heard the first bid is 40. All right, so that was number two. Rick, don't confuse us. What are you doing? Yeah, I'm going to confuse you. Right now? Oh, that's number one? What's, you're not going to go to that? I got a $40 bid. <laughs> I got a $40 bid. What about this water bottle? $139. It looks like R2D2, and it is not. It is United States. The Saturn V. It's a Saturn V. Thank you. It's a Saturn V. Is that the S4B or is that the. Here, we'll pass it around to you. I think it's the Saturn V. Hey, Randy. Just ask her when she's holding it up. Just for a moment so the camera gets it. Make sure, make sure it's in front of the camera so all these people at home can go ooh and ah and say, dang, I should have been at NARM this year. <laughs> anyway, five bucks. Five bucks for a water bottle. A good water bottle for five dollars. Five dollars. Right there. Five dollars. Brand new. Five dollars. you're going to stand still, right there is perfect. <laughs> no one wants this for five dollars. All right, we'll put it on the table. We'll do it again later. Amanda? No, let's bundle it. Pick something to bundle, Amanda. We're going to bundle. We're not going to put stuff aside. Got to hurry up a little more. Don't rush. <laughs> what about this V2? Yes, V2 and a Saturn V. Five dollars now. Five dollars for the two. Five. Okay, how about ten? Ten. How about fifteen? Ten dollars going once. Buzz. Fifteen. Fifteen going once. Going twice. Come on, 20 bucks for the So, 15 bucks. Buzz gets it. Right? Oh, yeah, 139 and 103. 139 and 103. Yeah. 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 Somebody give me 10 bucks. Great. How about 15? Fifteen dollars. Hi, how's it going? Fifteen, right there. Twenty. Hi, Steve. I got twenty right there. Anybody for twenty-five? Come on, Steve's got it for twenty right now. Special. Yeah. Twenty bucks. I hear twenty-five from anybody. Twenty-five. Come on. Twenty bucks going once. Come on, don't stick them with it. 20 bucks going twice? All right, stick it with it. So, 20 bucks. Right. Steve Humphrey. Right. <laughs> <laughs> 27. <laughs> you just got to be careful who you're friendly to when you walk in the room. That's all you got to say. I will never be friendly with you again. <laughs> <laughs> all right, number all right. 12, the mystery box. The mystery box. Oh my, it's a mystery it? box. Yeah, let's shake. Alright, <laughs> I heard enough. 
right. Mystery box from Estes. Let's see, is it from Estes? Yes. Yeah, it's yeah, from Estes. Estes packs right at it. Uh, let's go 10 bucks. 10, how about 20? Gotta have 20. Hey, Chris, I hear you. It feels pretty good. 20 bucks? Okay, how about 25? 25. Oh, Mark Crumpkin wants this for 20 bucks. Nobody wants it for 25. 25. 25. Who said that? Oops. Good job, Marie. Oops. 25. Can I hear 30? Mark, 30. Steve, 30. Thank you. 35, anybody? All right, now 35. 35. Steve's going to get it for 35 bucks. Going once. Going twice. 40. No, 35. 35. Sold. All right. $35. Man, that is a deal. All right, I've got some Estes Diamond Pack, one half A6 zeros. There are three packs. Howdy, gang, how's everybody doing? Good, that's about a dollar bid there. How about 10? How about 10? Anybody go for 10 for the Diamond Pack? 10 bucks right down here. How about 15? 15? See, there's your first bid, wasn't it, Marty? <laughs> How about 15? Anybody for $15? Pack of Diamond Pack Motors. $15. Okay. We are going once, twice. Nobody wants to give me fifteen dollars for this thing. All it's right. a steal. It costs more than that. Then. Yeah, no kidding, no kidding. Uh, Bob uh, Justice, right? Bob Justice, right there. I can't wait. For how much? Right.
like $30 for it. $25, $30 with Roger. Okay, $30 right here, $35. $35, $35, $35. Is that how it goes? Yeah. yeah. Uh, $35 going once, going twice. $40. $40. Ooh. Last second bid, $40 in the back. Uh, right here, $45. Roger, $45. No, $40 going once, twice. So, $40, Gary Beaver. All right, round well, two, Gary Beaver. Beaver. What's next there, Amanda? Oh, let's do some books. I'll take books, Amanda, and we'll just go with books when you're busy. Uh, Man in the Space Frontier and Shuttle Down by Lee Corey. So, here's the start of the sign. That's his big order. Really? I guess they don't read enough. All right, so we got a G. Harry book. A couple of G. Harry books. All right, uh, ten dollars. Anybody? A couple of G. Harry books. Ten. How about fifteen? Fifteen bucks. We got. How about twenty? Pam, twenty. Go for it. Twenty dollars. About twenty-five. Twenty-five. Pam, thirty. Okay, Bob. Twenty-five. Anybody else? Thirty dollars. Twenty-five going once, twice, sold. Bob Justice, thirty dollars, one thirty-eight. All right, Vanna has number sixteen. I need everybody very quiet. Okay, the try me button doesn't work. <laughs> but the M Ms come inside. <laughs> we have an authentic Star Wars M M dispenser. All right, very good. What year is that, Amanda? <laughs> I want to know how stale those are. <laughs> <laughs> All right, five bucks. M and Spencer, five bucks. We got a five dollar bid. How about ten? We got a ten dollar bid. How about fifteen? <laughs> okay, eleven dollars. Eleven dollars. Okay, twelve dollars. Do I hear twelve? I got twelve. Do I hear thirteen? Great, 13. Okay, $12 going once, going twice. So, Gary Beaver's youngster. <laughs> All right. Um, Star Trek, 30 years. This is lot 130. Star Trek, the collectibles. Star Trek memorabilia. Star Trek where no one has gone before. And the art of Star Trek. All right, this looks pretty cool. Oh yeah, all kind of color, colored pages. Man, looks good. Ten dollars. Do I hear ten dollars for the set? Pam wants them for ten. Fifteen? Twenty? 20 bucks. Nice set. You got 100 bucks worth of books at least here. Okay? Where are we at? 20? 25? 20? No, he was at 15, not at 20. You're at 20. Keep up in my bids. Keep up in my bids. Oh, no. He's just kind of 25. Bob, 25? Oh, come on. Somebody's got to do better than 20. Come on. 25 dollars. All these Star Trek books. One of these books cost that much. Now. That's right. right. Yep, absolutely. <laughs> 25. You got 25. How about 30? Come on. Come on. 30 bucks. This book alone is $50 in the U.S. Yeah, it's for Canon. And in Canada, it's 65 <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, Let's see. Let's see. Okay. Okay. 25 bucks. Going once. That's it, guys. Twice. So, Bob Justice, I don't want 25. The I want y'all to get more than 25 for it. I know. All right, 130 to Bob. <laughs> <laughs> That's not dollars. That's a lot. Okay. Right, book. Oh, thank you. Well, I'll do Okay. G. Harry Stein, Handbook of Model Rock Tree. Is this first edition? First edition. Yes. That's first, first edition. edition. Randy, that's the first edition of the first edition. This is the first edition of the first edition. First 20 cents. Yes. First printing of the first edition. Wait a minute. How much was it originally? 20 cents. I'm afraid to open it. No, it's a good thing. It's not. Uh, what would you open it? On the back. Go here to the edges. Yeah, yeah. That just doesn't say. $10. Dollars. 
Anyway, 20 cents. $10. $10. Hooray! 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 Can I have 15? Okay, I'm doing 15. How about 20? I want 20 bucks. 20 bucks right back here. Anybody for 25? Come on, 25. 25. First edition. I want 30 bucks. Can we get 30 bucks here for first edition? I'll pay 30 bucks. Go 35. First edition. 30, 35. Where are you here? 40. Huh? $40. How about 45? Come on, $45. Great edition to somebody's collection. $45. 40 bucks going once. 45. Yes. 45. Great. Uh, $50. Somebody go 50 bucks? Come on, it's worth 50 bucks. Okay, $45 going once. Going twice. Sold. $45. Yay. Valuable gets the One forty-two. Okay. You are good. Anna is on top right now. We have Star Wars blueprints. 13 by 19. There's a boatload of them in here. The Empire, Empire Strikes Back notebook. And it's full of um, all kinds of miscellaneous drawings and stuff. Return of the Jedi official collector's edition. The Star Wars uh, portfolio. Star Wars, Hero, and Family News Clipping in the back. Oh, this is, uh, these are all conceptual hmm. drawings and pictures. <laughs> <laughs> and these are dated 1977. Do you see the live stream? It's just as the movie was being made. Okay, 10 bucks. Looking for 10 bucks for the lot. $10? I'll bid $10. How about 15 15 bucks? Oh my. $10 going once? No. Randy, what are we bidding on? Sorry, I got to talk. We're bidding on 38. Just say 20. All right. We're going to we got to add to that. Who, raise your hand if you're a Star Wars fan. Click on the patch. <laughs> no, raise your hand if you're a Star Wars fan. Click on the patch. Click on the patch. Come on. And on the left oh hand side, this is YouTube playlist. Everybody's going like this. On the left. <laughs> right there. Here's the playlist. Hmm, how do people see their lives? Okay, we're going to bundle. With this? I assume they went to my page, they would see the live. Thirty-nine has got Jedi book, comic books, and stuff. Jedi books, popular mechanics. Uh, That's Star just Wars the first stuff. video I put up. Essential vehicle information, a huh. sketchbook, all kinds of great Star Wars stuff. Interesting. Okay, now anybody would want twenty-five? Anybody give twenty-five for two? Twenty-five. Twenty-five. Where's thirty? Come on, I want thirty dollars. Oh, come on! I don't want to have to add more. <laughs> I'll give you 30. Who said that? Good, thank you, sir. How about 35? 35. Rick, 30, 30, 40? Where are the real Star Wars fans? Okay, 40. 40. Pam, 45? Okay, $40. I just assumed if they went to the playlist, it would also take them to the live video. I guess it doesn't. $40 is just not enough. Huh. How about we had one of That's these? a failing on my part. I, I just assumed it was automatic. <laughs> oh, there's interest now. $45. i am looking for $45. Rick's got $40. I want 45 Come on, 45 How about 45 Anybody want 45 I'll do 45 hey, hey, you okay? Yeah, $45. we got $45. How about 50 Hey, they you guys have seen this trick before, haven't you? Okay, I'm looking for fifty-five dollars. Fifty-five dollars. How about sixty? Chris, sixty. That's a lot of good stuff for sixty. Come on in, guys. Yeah, come on in. Sixty bucks. I'm looking for sixty More bucks. That's victory. a lot of snacks for sixty. Where were we anyway? Who had that last? Fifty-five right here. Fifty-five. We got fifty-five going once. 
55 gone twice. Nobody's gonna give me 60 bucks for that haul. 60 in front. 60! Look at this. Sweet. I told you to wear his other hearing aid. I'm right now, turn it up. <laughs> Alright. I can't, still can't hear a damn thing, but that's okay. 65, what for 65? Okay, pay him where it's 70. No, 65 bucks. 65 going once, twice, sold. 60 bucks. Yeah, I don't know. You may bring their microphone. There's one in the scale room. Right, I 
All right. Touch the nose cone. It's nice and smooth. Yeah, very nice basswood nose cone. Ten dollars. How about fifteen? Thirty. Thirty dollars. Thirty-five. How about forty? Forty bucks. Fifty. Looking for fifty bucks. Forty-five. Fifty. No. Fifty dollars. Looking for fifty dollars. Forty-five. I'm at. We're at forty-five. I'll take. I'll take forty-five. Not looking for fifty. Day fifty. Fifty bucks. Nose cones worth fifty bucks. <laughs> More than fifty dollars. Nose cones worth fifty dollars. Forty-five dollars going once. Going twice. Forty-five dollars. That's it. Nice. That's it. Dude. Forty-five dollars. Going once. Going twice. Sold for forty-five dollars. Very nice. Hey Randy, can we hold on a second too? Can you explain to everybody what this auction's for? What this going towards? What's that? It's going to replace the one that's hanging out. Okay, so in 2019. All right, hey, I want to thank everyone for coming to the auction. This auction is to raise money for those schools that need help. Um, funding rocketry programs, rocketry builds and launches. And it's great because they, the teacher can apply for a scholarship of $500 and we award quite a few of them. They've been fully funded for a number of years. We do have a little bit of bank, but this is continuing to support that so that we can provide a lot of different funding for these schools that need them. I'm not even sure what we're up to now, but 10 or 15 schools every year get money because of what you guys do here. So thank you very much for doing this and bid high and bid often. All right, item number 26, another designer special. Let's go 10 bucks to start. Come on, I gotta have $10. Ten dollars from Buzz. Twenty? Fifteen? From Pam. Twenty bucks, anybody? <coughs> Twenty bucks. Fifteen to Pam. Going once. Going twice. Sold. Fifteen bucks. Number 26 to Pam Gilmore. Fifteen. Artillery of the world and pictorial history of uh, world spacecraft. A uh, couple of nice books. Lot 41. 50 cents. How about a dollar? Dollar. How about two dollars? I'm bidding against myself. I know you are. Ten dollars. I really appreciate it. Come on, ten dollars. But did you win? Come on, ten dollars. Ten dollars. Ten dollars for Bob. I'm sorry. He keeps, he keeps bumping it up, and I think that's a good idea. How about twenty dollars? Twenty dollars. How about twenty-five? <laughs> How about we add a box and take twenty-five? I know you don't, but sorry. <laughs> twenty-five bucks. Come on, I'll give you a box. A box yeah. and a box and a box in the books. Twenty-five bucks. This is the box. <laughs> this is Estes. Thirty bucks. Twenty-five bucks to Chris. Thirty. Thirty. Very good. How about thirty-five? Where did I hear that thirty-five? Thirty-five. Okay. How about 40 bucks? 40 bucks from Chris. How about 45? The box number is hidden. Ten. Um, ten. What's the book again? The book is um, Artillery of the World and World Spacecraft. See, I want this in my office, so I hope you get this. 50 bucks, keep the box. 50 bucks, keep the box. I want 55 and take the box. <laughs> 55? 55, I'll take the box. 55, he wants the box. <coughs> okay. 60. Yeah. <laughs> 60 dollars, anybody? Okay, 50 dollars, 55 dollars. Going once, twice, sold the Lee Berry for 55 dollars. <laughs> In your office, right? Well, the books will look in my office. Where are we going next, Amanda? You want to bring some of the plates and stuff? Yeah, the best items in the auction.
production, and it is a Flatscraft uh, plate set, uh, Star Trek 6. The cup is Enterprise. Uh, it's got a saucer with it, and the plate is also monogrammed, so you got to take that saucer off of there. there. 25! 25, how about 50? Which Enterprise? Uh, Undiscovered country. Uh, 7, 1701A. This is it. It's from Star Trek 6. Star Trek 6. Read the map. Oh my god. The prelude to peace. It's a very nice, uh, um, very nice stuff on the back. So, anyway, where are we at? We're at $40. Somebody give me 40 bucks. Never use it. Forty dollars, John Hockheimer there in the back. How about forty-five? We had a little much money to the nursing. Forty-five, anybody? Forty-five. Forty-five. How about fifty? Fifty bucks. All right, fifty bucks. Okay, forty-five dollars going once. It's going for forty-five dollars twice. Sold for forty-five dollars. Two. I know what this is. Uh, Bob, uh, what's his name? What's his name? Justice. Hey, Amanda, justice show me the plate. There's more settings. There is no justice. There's more settings. There is no justice. There we go. That's a good one. Wait till you see the beer mug. That's a whole Thank you. I've got a uh, Narin 43 clock. Ah, it's one of my clocks. No, it's not a belt buckle, it's a clock. Um, Geneseo, New York, 2001. No, I don't think it has an alarm. Uh, it needs a battery. Oh, it's made in China. Alright, five bucks. So you give me five bucks for the clock. Come on, five dollars for a clock. No, it's battery operated. I made those. You made them? <laughs> I can't believe one still exists. <laughs> we want to bundle something with this, Amanda? Okay, I've got a bunch of magazines and an RMS motor. Oh, look at this. Um, Oh my gosh, this is rare. This is motor hardware. It is. You can't get motor hardware these days. Uh, this is a 2460 uh, motor casing. And uh, as everybody knows, uh, you can't buy these right now because nobody has any. Uh, but anyway, a motor casing with a bunch of nice magazines and a, cl and a clock. Amanda. They're all kind of from here. Number? What's numbers? 108, 17. Yeah, 108 and 17. Five bucks. ET fans? Five bucks right here. How about ten? Ten bucks. How about fifteen? Fifteen bucks, anybody? Fifteen dollars. Fifteen dollars. With the clock. No, with the clock. I'm making you take it. How about twenty? Twenty bucks. Twenty bucks over here. About twenty-five. I'd like twenty-five for the lot. Twenty-five bucks. Twenty bucks going once. Twenty bucks going twice. Sold to Roger for 20 bucks. Roger was on. Roger, I don't get any An Estes uh, Invader. Invader. Estes Invader, I'd like $5 for the Invader. Make sure the clock. $5. Going to Roger. Five bucks. Five dollars for an invader. We need to sell this. Okay. Five bucks for an invader. Can't sell an invader for it's, five dollars? It's great for multi-stage saucers. You chat stage that thing right on top of an 18 millimeter. How about some to go with it? Oh, boy. These are Centuri half Yeah, 13 millimeter. Half A4s, 5M. So these are... Somebody tell me here, are these uh, 13 millimeter? 13 They are 13 millimeters, okay. They will not work in this, but... <laughs> okay, there's three packs here, and uh, now I'd like $5. Five bucks for the, for the, for the, for the batch, for the pack. Five bucks, Buzz wants little motors. He loves little motors. When he plays contests and stuff, give it Steve, they go neck to neck, don't you guys? All right. How about motors have sure shots in them? How about 10? 
I think they have to, don't they? Don't worry, the box is not sealed. Sure shots. Okay, how about five bucks? Okay, how about five bucks? Come on, I got it. Five dollars. That's a lot of motor. I said five bucks. Put it. We're at 15? No. I want to be at 15. Okay, 10 bucks. Somebody give me 10. Come on, somebody give me 10. 10! Who's got kids? We're down 10 dollars. $10. $10. How about 15? How about 15? It's Rachel's first rock. That should be special. Okay, here's some A8Os that'll work in that saucer. No, they won't. No, they won't. 13 millimeter. Oh, they are. Oh, so those motors will work. Okay, so let's throw some A8Os in. Three diamond packs from Estes, lot 135. I'll throw those in as well, but I need $15. 15. Okay, how about 20? Come on, 20 bucks. 20 bucks. Bunch of motors. 20 bucks. Oh my gosh, $15. Come on. Okay, what else can we add, Amanda? Another pack of motors? Okay, A10Os. A10Os. Two, three diamond packs of A10Os. I want $20. Okay, how about $25? I'll give $25. How about $30? $30. Bucks. $25 going once. Come on, I want $30. $25 twice. Come on, $30. Bucks. Thank you, dude. Okay, do I hear 35? You remember my name. Yes. <laughs> 35. Come on, I need $35. Oh, come on. $35. Come on. Come on, that's what? A couple of high power motors? Okay, I'm giving you $35. How about 40? <laughs> Did I go to 35 all of a sudden? I went to 35. But I went to yeah, 40. I got 40. Really? 45. I was just doing medium right now. Put something else in. One of those. Take the box. And throw something in there. Take the box and put it in. Add a mystery box. No! Whatever. No. No. Okay, what do we have? Am I at 45? You want you, you give me 50 for this? I mean, this is a special. Take the money and later away. No, let's leave it in there. Five. Come on. Something you have to pay. 50 bucks. Okay, I'm going for five. I do? Anybody go 60? <laughs> All right, 55 once. And three back four Twice. Back 60 if it's the last one. Come on. You go up, you got it. Okay, you got it. 60 bucks, last one. Thank you. All right, All right 60 bucks. Bob Justice got that. <laughs> All right, we're doing, that was 135, 133, 132, 131, and 137. Got it? Yeah, yeah, got it. Got it. All right, we're at 143, which is the Sputnik plastic model. It's an Apex model. Is this convertible? Anybody know? Yeah, it is. It is, and it's made in Russia. That's a Russian. Yeah. Is it originally sealed? Uh, it is not. <laughs> it is not. There's, there's no guarantee to all the parts are there. Are the instructions in Russian or English? Um, yes. Translated from the original Japanese. Both. <laughs> As Pam said, translated from the original Japanese, yes. And pictures, too. So pictures. Those people have trouble with words. Five bucks. I like five bucks. How about ten? Ten dollars? Come on, five dollars. Okay, five dollars going once. Five dollars going twice. No, no, this one's gone for five dollars. Because, you know, we got, we got a new bidder here. All right.
Pat, this is group 15, and this is a Darth Vader, a C-3PO, a Han Solo, and a clone trooper. They are Christmas ornaments. They would look great on my tree. They're m and in Star Wars. Oh, oh yeah, they're m and in Star Wars. So what are you bidding on them, Reddit? Isn't that cool? Five bucks. Yeah, $10. Thank you very much. Anybody for 15? 15. Good. 20? Can I get 20? 20 bucks? 20 bucks. I'm looking for 20 bucks. Decorate your Christmas tree. Come on, twenty dollars for some Christmas ornaments. Okay, what are we adding to this package, Amanda? We're gonna add these. Yeah. Okay, we're gonna throw some Pez dispensers in here. You get another twenty dollars. You get Pez too. Twenty bucks. Yoda and Darth Vader. Twenty bucks. Okay, we got twenty. How about twenty-five? Twenty-five. Twenty-five. How about thirty? Nick, thirty. Thirty bucks. How about forty? Somebody give me 40 bucks. We got $35 going once, going twice, sold, $40, $35. That was 15 and 18, and I'm sorry, I don't have name. That was the Olmstead uh, party. Olmstead or Marty? Yeah, Olmstead. Yeah, Olmstead. Amanda. Okay, this is the number 134, original one, 1950s. Um, lead Sweetie Crayon Sharpener uses nose cone for the Orville Carlisle Mark II. All right, it's an original. Looks like it's in very good shape. It's, of course, it's $5. Come on, so five, how about $10? $10, looking for $10? How about $15? 15, 20, can I have $20? 20, 20 bucks, how about 25? Come on, it's a pencil sharpener. It's worth every penny of 25 bucks. <laughs> I, I, it's a pencil. And Randy, I believe you have a kit that goes with it. <coughs> is there, oh, I have one, yeah, but I don't promote my stuff. Oh, if it goes to 25, I'll throw in a free kit. Anybody give me 25? Go ahead. 25, who wants it? Where was I, was here, Tom? We're 20. 15. I don't know. Oh, you went to 15? <laughs> okay. All right. Can we go to 25? I'll throw in the kid that it goes with. 20 bucks. Wow. 20 going once, twice, sold. 20 bucks. Head chest. Okay. This one is 117. Signed by a girl. All right. 117. A model rocket news. I don't know how you get one that's this perfect, so I don't know where this came from. But of course, Bern and Glita have signed it. I'm afraid to open it. It is perfect. It is perfect. It is the fall of 1990 edition. Can I get five dollars for this? God. How about 10? It's got Vernon Glita's signature on it. 10 bucks. How about 15? I'll 15? take it for 15. Okay. How about 20? 20 bucks. 20. 20. How about 25? 25 bucks. Nice addition. 20 bucks. Going once. Going twice. Sold. 20 bucks. Number 117 to Bob Justice. <laughs> what are we doing next, Amanda? More signature stuff, right? No? 150? Yes. yes? They have signed this t shirt somewhere. <coughs> right? I just saw it. <coughs> one is signed, one is not. Okay, yeah, let's do that one first. And then we'll get the signatures going. Now, Vern, you have something special about this shirt, don't you? Yeah. This is uh, the shirt has uh, been signed by both Cleet and I. And uh, on the front, we have Cleet uh, uh, and Vern pen, and we have an Estes pen on it. This is a, a large XL size and um, <laughs> it's, a, it's, it's from the year 2000. It was at Estes Land in Colorado where we had this shirt. Some of you 
maybe you already have one, but you don't have those signatures, and you don't have those bands. So that's right. Let's show it. That's right. Okay. Come on. Twenty-five, Vern. Start the bid at twenty-five. Go for it. Let's do start twenty-five. Anywhere. Twenty-five. Twenty-five. How about thirty? Okay. I want thirty dollars. I'll go thirty. How about forty dollars? Forty. Forty. How about fifty dollars? I need fifty dollars for a T-shirt. It's a, it's a rocketeer medium. <laughs> <laughs> what are we at? We're at $50. Somebody give me $50. 50. How about $60? $60. Come on, $60. Somebody's got to give me $60. I'll give it $60. How about $70? $70. Bucks. Bob's got $70. How about $80? Awesome looking pins. It's the uh, uh, 2006 uh, Vernon Glita Estes pin and a really outstanding uh, Space Corps Estes pin. Uh, how about $75? Anybody give me $75? $75. I'll give $75. How about $80? Somebody give me $80? 80 bucks. How about $90? $90. Come on, I need $90. We can do $90. It's worth it. $90. I want a $100 bill. First $100 item of the day. $100 bill. Yes. Dave's looking at it, and it's his size, too. <laughs> One size fits all. I need a hundred bucks. We can do a hundred bucks. We got a deal here. Steve, hundred bucks. You can do it? Come on, ninety dollars. We're, we're at ninety dollars right now, right? You're gonna go on, Bob's going a hundred. Tom, hundred and ten. Can you do it? You can beat me at hundred and ten. I won't go you want it for 110? Bob's saying yeah, but I haven't figured out what I'm doing yet, so. <laughs> this guy here's 110. Okay, I'm looking for 120. 120 bucks for a t shirt. For a good cause. Very good cause. That's how many rockets is that, Tom? That's probably uh, 22 rockets, right? <laughs> Typically, that's 22 rockets for kids to build, uh, uh, build yeah, rockets. See that yes, sir. We're at $120. I'm looking for $120. Yes. Yeah, but I made a promise. Okay, we're at 110 Going once. Going twice. Sold. 110 All right, we have a second one. It also has the pins on it. That's a It's the same year. Now, when we were coming here, I told Plita that I was going to have her wear a shirt, and I was going to sell that shirt right off her back. <laughs> that was a short discussion. <laughs> So I did the next best thing. This is the shirt that she was wearing out in the range yesterday. And um, yeah, that's the right one. <laughs> and, uh, it is, uh, what was I going to say? <laughs> it's for sale. So All right. All right. All right. All right. It's, it's an it's infant size rocketeer. It's an actual medium. medium. I'm doing 20. I'm starting at 20. 20? Medium. Okay, how about 25? She'll be glad to autograph it. 25. 25. Where's 25? Carol? How about 30? I'll do 30. How about 35? Come on, baby. Here's 35. How about 40? 40 bucks. You want it? 40 bucks. You got a big one. $40? 40 dollars? <laughs> 45. 45? How about 50? Why, Amanda? 50 bucks over here, but how about 55? Yeah, he's about a quarter. 55 bucks? Okay, how about 60? I'd like $60 for it. Hey, Randy, we'll make a great Christmas present for Amanda. No. She's got a toddler that wants to get it, so. Uh, where are we at? We're at $60. Anybody give me $60? $60 to Steve. How about 65? 
65, 70, Steve? How about 80, Carol? Go ahead, hey, Carol, 80. 80 bucks, Steve, 90. $90, Carol's gonna cost you 100 bucks. You got it. You got it, how about 110? Okay. 110. All right, you get those Good, Carol, 120. 120. They have not, but they said they will. So you can have the Kodak moment along with it as well. 125 with their signature. With the Kodak moment. With the Kodak moment. So we're at 125. Okay, do I hear 130? <laughs> now, Lena says that this could be her last NARAM, but I don't believe that in the no. But, let's, you know, come on. If you want something from the Estuses, this is the time to get it. Okay, we're at 125, right? Can I get 130? <laughs> is it authenticated? This is a um, Denver edition, uh, catalog 261. It's a replica, but it's essentially identical to that original catalog, which, and this is copied from, from the uh, one I paid $850 for on eBay. <laughs> and, wow. um, and the original is now at the Museum of Flight. Um, this hey, hey, catalog hey, hey, hey. has been autographed by Glita. She stitched it in 2014 on her sewing machine, just like the original was made. And so, let's go for it. All right. Um, let's see. On the back, Robert L. Robinson was supposed to get this in Indiana. He didn't get, get it. Instead, it. Instead, it. instead, we're auctioning it off. Twenty-five bucks. This is lot 147. Okay, I got 25, 30, 35, 40, 40 bucks. Oh, come on, $40. This is a rare item, 40. How about 50? 50. I'd like $50, how about 60? Looking for $60. $50, going once, going twice. Oh, I can't do it. I'll give $60. Will you give 70? You rap. 70. $70. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, gosh. I, I'm going to go 75. We go 80. I'm going to yield. You're going to yield? I got it for $75. Anybody give me 80? I don't want to be unfair to anybody. Okay, $75 sold to me. I have some uh, electronic devices here that was given to me to be sold at auction. It's from Ed Brown. Ed started working for Estes Industries in the mid-60s. He was a Mabel operator for years. He became manager of the Estes uh, uh, rocket manufacturing and he retired uh, sometime time late in the tuning administration. I don't have all the detail on that. But this is some uh, test equipment, amplifiers and uh, that type of thing. There are two discs in here with about 3,000 uh, files on each of them. I saw that there were emails that Ed had with different people and so on. And the, uh, I can't tell you exactly uh, how the test equipment works or what it is because I really don't know. But I would suggest that this is a historic item and sell it. All right. Anybody interested in taking a look at this? Let's see if we can. Yeah. 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 Looks like we've got a USB on one side, another part that goes in 
your computer. Got some kind of switchboard here. Probably the valuable stuff here is the CDs. They are CDs, not paper tape or anything. So, you know, we're good. Not floppy disks no either. No floppy disks either. Oh, push buttons. Uh, a lot of basic components that have not been assembled. Uh, some components that have been assembled. It looks like another kit. Is that an Arduino? Uh, no, absolutely not. But it sure looks like uh, this goes something in here. <laughs> Stuff. Yeah, lots of assembly required on one, the other looks like it's assembled. Looks like it'll take a rocket scientist. It will take a rocket scientist to pull this one off. This one needs a 9-volt battery. Where's the grandfather, are they? There's some sort of game on the air. Yeah, those are not buttons. No, they're the green button wires. Alright, some miscellaneous historical items for $25. Do we get any idea of what these miscellaneous historical yeah. items are? Yeah. Uh, if, if you buy the disc, you will find out. <laughs> I'll give you $25. $25 for a box of miscellaneous historical parts. It doesn't include the disc. And it includes the disc. Yep. Yeah, papers. How about $30? Maybe those papers say what it is. We got a $30 bid. How about 35 $35 for assorted miscellaneous six two parts. $35 I'm looking for. Those papers might say what it is. Uh, yeah, it's got more information. It says it's assembly and testing. It's a load cell amplifier. The date on the boards is 2009. Measure and recording thrust curves of rocket motors. It has a small mm. front footprint, a couple of advantages over its previous designs. Key advantages allow a user to set the zero line, the base voltage, which would allow measurements to be taken. Uh, let's see if there's anything else. It's 18 volt. So it's for motor thrust test yeah. Yeah. Requires safety glasses. <laughs> <laughs> so this is a corporate thing. Safety glasses are in there. Yeah. All right, I'm at $30. Anybody interested in giving me $30? Or am I at $35? I'm at $35, aren't I? We went $30, right? $20, $25, $30? Okay, I'm looking for $35. $35. Bucks. $30 going once. He's got it at $30. Going twice. Scott Alexander. So, $30. Okay, Vern, what's up next? Okay, I have one final item. This is uh, one of the Golden yeah. Scout kits that uh, uh, Carl was put out by Simrock and Carl. And, uh, uh, I don't know if Simrock does any. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Which number is this? This is number 992. Right. And then I'll, there's also an envelope here that has the official uh, Penrose. Cancellation stamp to recognize that event uh, was used at that time. So you can describe it. All right, a Golden Scout from the program um, for the 15th anniversary. This was 10 years ago, folks. 60 years next year, nine years ago. All right, $25. Anybody give me $25? 25 How about 30 30 bucks. I'm looking for $30 for the Scout. It is a special Penrose spoke postmark on the envelope. It's dated August 26th of 2008. Okay, I'm at $30. Anybody give me $30? $30. Great program. How many people participated in this program? Awesome. Look at all the hands go up. This is so sweet. Uh, 30 bucks. I'm looking for $30. All right, $30 going once. I'm sorry, we're at 25. I'm looking for 30. I'm looking for 30. Come on, nobody's going to give me 30 bucks. 25 going once. I'm sorry. Going twice. <laughs> so, we get this for 25. 25 bucks. Holy totally. smokes. Who are you? Dave Cook. Dave Cook. Lot 29 is a Viking bulk kit from Estes, a flutterby by Estes, and another flutterby by Estes. 
I'd like five dollars for lot 29. Five dollars. Anybody give me five? I gave you five. Five. How about ten? Give me ten. No, five bucks. We're gonna add to it. You want more for that? Sure. No. <laughs> sure. No. Here, try this one. How about this one? Okay. Or parachute. Yeah. All right, we're going to add to it. We're going to add a dark energy. This is uh, number 100 and the executioner. Now we give me 10 bucks. Don't give me 10 bucks. Give me 10 bucks. Good. How about 15? I want 15, Marie. $15. Yeah. yeah, $15. How about 20? So I give me 20 bucks. That's a great lineup of rockets. Let's change the paradigm. 17. 17 dollars. <laughs> now I'm looking for 1750. Roger, go 1750. 18. How about 19? 20 dollars. Roger's back to normal. <laughs> okay, somebody give me 25. All right, Roger's gonna get it for 20. 20. Who gave the 21? 25. Roger's getting us out of that. 25. 25 bucks. Going once. 22. Going 20. He's got 25. <laughs> 26. How about 30? 26. Going once. Going twice. Sold. $26. <laughs> Okay, flutter by. This is one of my favorite rockets. Estes made a mistake when they designed it. They should have tethered them together so you don't have to chase after two parts. Here's lot 34, and we've got three of them. I'd like five dollars for this group. Five dollars. Flutter by. Flutter by. Three, three of them. All right, five dollars. Thank you. Thank you. How about ten? How about ten? I'd like ten dollars. Can I get six, at least two dollars a piece? Yeah, yeah, six dollars. At least? Six, six dollars, Steve. I gave you five. I know, Bob's going six. Good job, Bob. Let's get a pricing score going. Seven dollars. Seven. Seven. Bob, eight. Eight. Nine. Different bottles. How about ten? How about ten? At least ten nine, three dollars a piece. Who wants to do ten? Ten. 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 How about eleven? How about eleven dollars? Come on, let's have some excitement to this room. Eleven dollars. Okay, eleven bucks. That's Twelve. Got a dark energy. Very nice. And we're gonna go for five bucks. Four bucks. Five. Five, five bucks. Okay. Six bucks, six. How about seven? Seven? Come on, six bucks. Seven. Eight bucks. Give me eight bucks, somebody. Eight dollars. How about nine? I want nine bucks. Nine dollars. Ten. Bob's down here with ten. How about eleven? Eleven dollar. Tom wants eleven. How about twelve, Bob? All right, eleven dollars. Eleven dollars going once. Twelve here with Roger. How about thirteen? Thirteen. How about fourteen, Roger? Fourteen bucks. Fourteen bucks. Tom, fifteen. Fifteen dollars. Now we're rolling. Okay, sixteen bucks. Anybody go for sixteen? Sixteen. Sixteen dollars. Okay, we're at fifteen going once, going twice. So fifteen bucks. Okay, ninety-five. <laughs> Surprise, surprise, more flutterbys. We have three of them. All right, I lost the number. Oh, here it is, 33. That's 33. This is skill level one. So great for kids. Absolutely. Tether them together, you don't have to chase both parts. Six dollars. Six, I was gonna start putting up at five, but our contest director wants to do six, so how about seven? Seven, how about eight? We got eight over here, Bob, nine? Ten. Ten, we got ten with Bob here. How about 11, Bob? Yeah, go ahead. Go ahead. No, come on. I want eleven dollars. Eleven. How about twelve? We got twelve here with Roger. Twelve dollars going once, going twice. Sold for Roger. Roger for twelve dollars. Number thirty-three. We good with this, Amanda? No. Nope. <laughs> All right, a V two and a. Shuttle. Okay. Okay, who's 
built a, an S in a shuttle so far? Marty has. No one in this room but Marty has flown an S, what, built an S in a shuttle yet? Come on, they made this for us. This is skill level four. Five. Skill level five. So that we have something fun to build that's more difficult than normal. Ten so bucks. Get, get, wait till you do the punchline. Oh. Who gave me ten? Okay. Ten bucks. How about eleven? Eleven dollars. Twelve. How about twelve? Twelve? Fifteen. How about twenty? Twenty bucks. How about twenty-five? I love 25, 25, how about 30? 30 bucks, 30, 30. Anybody give me 30 bucks, 30 bucks, how about 35? Okay, 30 bucks going once. 35, how about 40? 40, 35 going once, going twice. Sold, Roger Wolfong, 104. Oh, yeah, don't scratch your head, she said. Anybody give me 15 bucks? Come on, somebody give me 15 bucks. Okay, 12 bucks. I got 12. How about 13? I love $13. Come on, we want 13. Anybody want a bid? Call me. $13. Anybody give me $13? Come on. $12 then. Going once. Going twice. $12. I can't call you, your phone's off. Thank you. Oh, somebody just tried to call me and my phone's off. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you said it's on. How do you know? Oh, my phone's on. Yeah. <laughs> Is the ringer turned on? Oh, how about it's past 9 o'clock? Uh-huh. <laughs> yeah, that's why I couldn't get a hold of him. We'll be up at 11.30. He turns his phone off at 9. No, it automatically shuts the ringer off. Okay, anybody here a Deep Space Nine fan? No, I'm a Turk, nor fan. <laughs> Deep Space Nine, this is a, a saucer and plate set for Deep Space Nine. Ooh, that's the one with Jar Jar Binks. No, 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 no. It is part of the Bajor sector. And we've started at $25. Can I hear $30? Is there a wormhole in the cup? <laughs> Only if you don't want it. Only if you purchase it. Yeah, if you purchase it for thirty dollars, it includes the wormhole that's in the cup. <laughs> oh, that's worth thirty dollars. Come on, somebody give me thirty dollars. It's a wormhole. There, yeah. Come on, thirty dollars. Thirty dollars. You only got to be worried if you find half a worm. All right. Um. Got 25 for the cell. What's that? Solid. Barb, where's Barb? Barb. Okay, 25 bucks. Who who is on? Bobby, you're at 25. You take you're gonna take home, take care of it for 25. Okay. Maybe give me 30 dollars. This is it. I'm getting to Bob if now. Come on. Okay. Going once, twice. Sold. It needs a good home. All right. It's a beautiful piece. It's got a note here. Oh, it's the authentication paperwork. COA. Okay, lot number 98 is a Nike X, and the Nike X has a good tube in it, and a dark energy. Uh, I'd like $5 for the lot. Come on, Nike X is new and popular. $5, how about 10? Love 10, how about 15? 15 bucks, 10 bucks, come on, 15 people. 12. 12, good, I was just gonna go left. 13, 15, 15, how about 16? All right, 16. 16, 17, Tom? 17. Okay, good, 18? 17, going once, going twice. I might you saw for 18. <laughs> I got 19 up here. Okay. Randy. Amanda, 19. You ain't 19? 19. Amanda's getting this for me for Christmas. 19. Do I get 20, Tom? 20. You going 20? You're getting cold. I'm getting. 21. 21. Amanda, both ways. That's Amanda. 21. Wait, wait, wait. Whoa, did somebody?
Everybody say 20? 20? Yeah. 20? Okay, 21. 21. I don't need to know what it gets for Christmas. She did surprise me. 21? No, 20 bucks. Going once, going twice, sold. Right here. Oh, I already spent my budget. <coughs> okay, lot number 13 is Star Wars Monopoly. It's got all the characters in pewter or some type of metal. And it's a Monopoly game. And yes, it's all Star Wars places. The bounty hunter is there. They still go to jail. Trilogy edition. There's no free parking. Just the, the monotony in space. There's yeah. a Darth Vader R2-D2. See if she knows them all. And how long does it take to play? <laughs> Is there a Jar Jar Binks? No. You it's play by the rules, about 30 minutes. Stormtrooper. I don't know what that is. It's a 2004 edition. What's that picture? That's, uh, I don't know. Anyway, five dollars. Five dollars. How about ten? Gotta have ten. Star Wars game. Come on, buy it for the kids. How about 15? Everybody loves Monopoly. I need, I'm i looking for $15. 50. How about 20? 20, 20, 20, 15? 20. 20, how about 25? 25? 20, how about 25, 30, Amanda? Oh. Uh, 30, 25, 25. $25 going once. Going twice. Sold. $25. Hand launch glider. This is lot number 140. Hand launch glider from Sig. Uh, five bucks. How about six bucks? Six. Seven. 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 Eight. Anybody? Eight. Eight. Seven dollars. Eight. Party nine. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Party eleven. Twelve. Party's going to pay twelve. Going once. Going twice, sold, Marty. Woo. All right, we have a number of items in the auction that have minimums. If we can't get the minimum, they go to the next auction. Minimum. Uh, that's a hundred dollars. Ah! <laughs> um, and what this is is this is uh, Dale, part of Dale Green's collection of motors. Um, they have been broken down into different categories. Um, there's a number of European motors, Cox motors, Canarock motors, ABI motors, MCR motors, and Aerotech motors in this box. It looks like everything is long discontinued except the three Aerotech motors on the bottom. It is worth a minimum of 100 bucks. Anybody want to look at it? $100. Bob, are you going to go for it? I know you can. Andy, Randy, Yes. I can't take it home on the plane. Okay, stand by. Stand by. Can't mail it to you. All right, I tell you what, if somebody wants it mailed to their home, I will mail it to you if you cannot take it on the plane. Free of charge. <laughs> they cannot take it on the plane. Cannot take it on the plane, I will mail it to you if you need it mailed to you. I can do that. He mails me free things all the time. <laughs> yeah, of course. Sure. Hundred bucks? They're totally adding it Yeah, right. Maria said, was there a, Tom, was there a minute? I mean, what are, uh, that's the value. How did you determine the, the amount of the hundred dollars? The value on there is actually an estimate by Glenn Feverier, who I'm sure a lot of you know from the con contest community. Um, he was asked by the estate, the family of Dale Green, to provide an estimated valuation, so he went out and uh, looked at what motors it sold for in the past, that kind of thing, and gave his best shot at it. Um, and I can tell from some of the numbers on there, they're about half price. Half of what you would normally pay for those motors in a store. Of course, a lot of those motors are not available, so that was where Glenn was valuable at helping us determine its value. All right, there's a bunch of them. There's one for $90, there's one for $125, uh, there's another one for $100, uh, there's one for $81, and there's another for $90. Dale is a veteran motor collector of out-of-production motors. He frequently bought them. 
Pat and Aaron can auctions. So uh, this family was really pleased to hear that there was a possibility that we could sell that here. So. Um, and motors, motors are very tough to sell in auction, so we appreciate if you guys can step up to the plate and come up with these minimums. This one has a number of B14s. I know some people like those. Now, what was the price on that box? Uh, that was uh, $90. $90. $90 for a box with B14s. Anybody? Anybody give me 100 bucks for the net, for the $90 box? I'd like a hundred bucks for this. It's got, um, oh my gosh, it has got beef, not only B14s, but B14 zeros. Uh, three, four, five, six, seven, pack, seven packs of B19. Hundred bucks? Two coasters in this. Hundred bucks. Hundred bucks. Hundred ten? Steve? Oh, there's an SSI for two posters. No? Up to the hundreds. Yeah. 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 All right, we're looking to you to give us 110, Steve.
Look at that. How about 12? I got to have 12 bucks. Oh, $11 going once, going twice. $12, Bob. No. And Jess gets it for $11. It's going to Bob Justice. Thank you. Somebody give me 21 because the story's worth it. <laughs> and what's the chemical it's soaked in? A fire retardant. It's, it, it's secret. It's magic. 21. I'll give you $21. Steve, will you give me 22? Sure. I'll give me 23. Will you give me 24? Uh, <laughs> I just got 20 of those at the house, so I think. <laughs> So you just sold it to me for $23. But for Justin, yes, I, I will okay. buy it for you for $23. No, I was going to buy it for me for $24. Okay, you don't $25. Have... I'm at $25. Okay, I will buy it for me for $26. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> I'm done. You're done? So I get it for $26. Does anybody want to just roll for $27? Okay, now, everyone promise, do not tell my wife I just bought her <laughs> Seven dollars. Too late. Too late. Too late. I'm telling you. I give you twenty-five dollars. Sold. Oh, I'm gonna lose so much money on that deal. She's gonna be wiping my ass. Live chat. Just, live chat just popped up at your wife. She says you're dead. Oh. All right. This is the new spot, and these glasses are from anybody remember where these are from? Is this Burger Probably Burger King, King or somebody like that? Uh, McDonald's. China, 2008. Star uh, Trek Flexibles, we got a pair here. Is that the one with George Irving? They're glass. <laughs> no, it's um, the one with the This has Spock on it. Wrong movie. Yeah, wrong movie, don't go there. <laughs> uh, are there more of these? The there? Abrams Star Trek. There's, There's, only the There's only the two. There's only the two. Yes. Okay, all right, we're gonna sell the two, number 68 and 69. They're both Spock. I'd like uh, $5 for the glasses. $5, we got five, how about 10? We got $5 for the glasses, going once. Sold, $5. Chris Taylor. All right, anyone says. Number 127. Thank you. 
us up with something from there. Of course, the wonderful, pliable decal. Or not the one, but iron on. And it looks like it's in awesome shape, so that's usable. Yeah. A Centauri, another Centauri iron on. Boy, everything is like just like the packet from NARF 24. So clean and beautiful. Centauri Estes catalogs. Uh, mini book of model rocketry. A certificate. Oh, here's something good. The, the, the old designer manual. NARM 24 uh, iron on transfer. Yep. It looks brand new, too. All right, so this must have been somebody's NARM 24 packet and a bunch of other things. It's got all the, the Estes reports that were out at the time. And brand spanking new. So whoever gets this, if we don't have these scanned, we need to get some scans from you. All right, $5. Is this the pack? Does anybody know? Is this the packet it came in? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Really? Yeah. I missed okay. it. Right on the I know it's a label. Wow, that was a good point. Okay, five dollars. Get back on track. Sorry, it happens. Five dollars. How about ten? Somebody give me ten bucks. How about fifteen? Oh my gosh, this is a, a contestant's packet from Naram Twenty Four. Fifteen dollars. Twenty four. Twenty dollars. Somebody give me twenty dollars. How about twenty five? Naram Twenty Two. You don't need it. Best Naram ever. How about how about twenty five dollars? Thirty dollars. I'm looking for thirty bucks. Thirty bucks. The sun is pristine. Thirty bucks. Thirty dollars. How about thirty-five? Like thirty-five dollars for the packet. Thirty dollars going once. Going twice. Thirty-two. Thirty-two. Thirty-five. Thirty-five. Forty, John. No. Thirty-five going once. Going twice. Sold. Thirty-five dollars. Peter Alway has a Rockets of the World. That's for Marie. First edition. Ooh. Wait a minute. Is this really first edition? Yep, that's that was the first really first edition. Yeah, that was the first first edition. First first edition. Is it autographed? Yeah, yeah. It's here. It's here. We can get an autograph. It is not autographed, but he said he would autograph it. And uh, what do these go for new? They're twenty bucks at Narts, right? Let's start at twenty dollars. Somebody give me. How about 35? Uh, with the autograph. Yeah, that's it. Oh, oh, aren't they 20? They're 40 at Narts? Yeah, four. Okay, okay, 40 you bucks. Sure. How about 40 bucks? Somebody give me 40. 40 bucks autograph. 40 bucks autograph. 45? Somebody give me 45. First edition. Autograph. 40. $5. Come on! $40 going once. 45! Good boy. Oh. Girl. Okay, man. Forty-five dollars going once. Is going. Fifty-five, man. Did you say fifty? He said fifty. You want to go fifty-five? You want to go sixty? Sixty. Sixty. Gonna go sixty-five. Sixty-five. I thought I just did sixty. She did sixty. I did sixty. Seventy. Seventy. Seventy-five. Right. So we're sticking him with her. <laughs> 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 you don't have an edition of this one, right? Eighty. <laughs> <laughs> Eighty. 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 What? Ninety. 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 Though, it's the first copy. But there's no signature. Not yet, but there will be. 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 Hundred <laughs> 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 ten, one fifteen. Hundred twenty. Randy, while you're getting ready, nice spot. You might be getting that for Christmas. 
First, second, and third, or was lot 58? Lot 50 is the second edition shrink wrap. Okay. That's it. All right. So that's we got the first, second, and third. Okay. Yeah. So there's a separate set. Does anybody want? Oh my all gosh. Three I'm going to bring bidding back. Does anybody want to buy all three editions for $131? <laughs> <laughs> you forgot, please. Please. Okay. There's formerly Tom Seacross. Yeah. Tom was in our club. So drop it over there. All right. All right, I got a wrapped second edition book. Brand new, 20 bucks, starting at 20 bucks. Second edition. Come on, 20 bucks. I know everybody's got it, but this is the second edition. 20 bucks. 20 bucks. If no one buys this, we're going to send it to the next auction. 20 bucks. 25. I'm looking for 25. $20 going once, going twice. 25. 25 bucks. Bobby, you go 30. Chris, you go 30. 25 bucks. Going once. Going twice. Sold. 25 bucks. Okay. <laughs> What's next? VHS tape. VHS tape. Anybody still have a machine? Uh, yeah. It Five is a new thrift store. Five and bucks. V2 rocket test. 29 minutes. I think it goes with these. I'm not really sure. It doesn't matter. So this is German V2 test. Okay, there's a V2 book. And there is a German secret weapons blueprints for Mars. There is a V2 historic film collection. There's a Nova series on Hitler's secret weapons. What's the number, Amanda? 85. I thought of it. <laughs> And there's a bunch of V1 and V2 uh, pictures and information. Basically, it's for the V2 buff. Any V2 buff in here? Five bucks. Look this way. Right Five. How about ten? I'd like ten dollars for the V2 stuff. I saw a hair flick over here with that hand. No, but you should have this one too. Okay, let's add it. Uh, oh, is this book a long work a lot? Yes. yes, we better hold on. 
off on this one. Yeah. We'll do this one next, though, because whoever gets this one, maybe they want that one. So I'm at $5. Roger, you did five, right? Hold it up, Randy. How about 10 Anybody for $10? $10, looking for $10. They can convert these to CDs. $10, how about 15, Roger? 12? $10, going once, twice, 11, 12, 12, 15. $15, now I'd like one. Bill, 15, anybody go 16? Sold, $15, Bill saying dude. Here's a bag, you get a bag. Free, that's a freebie. All right, now we got a nice V2 book. V2 missiles of the third right, the V2, V1, and V2. It's lot number 42. Um, this is a very nice illustrated book. Lots of cool stuff. If you look in the back, it's got all the paint and the uh, paint patterns for V2. So. The paint patterns for V2s are in here. Like the Germans planned that. <laughs> oh, there's color. All right, I'd like $10 for the book. Can I get 10 bucks? 10, how about 15? 20? I'd like 20 bucks for the book. It's a $50 book. 20 bucks, 25 anybody? How about 30? 35? 40. Looking for $40. $40? 45 to you, Bill. 50 Bob? 50 anybody? $45 going to Bill in one for that. Going once, twice. So nice collection, buddy. Lot 51 is a blast off pack of motors, brand new seal from Estes. $15. What size? Uh, blast off pack, so it's got uh, a, a, B, C's and C's. So half of them are C's. 15? 20? 20? 20, 25? 25. 30? 20. Anybody give me 30 bucks? 25 for a box of the motors. All right, NHS. 51. Yeah. Lot 52 is another box of motors. 20. Same ones. 20 bucks. 20. 20, how about 25? 25. 25, how about 30? 30. How about 35? 35 bucks. $30 going once, going twice, sold. What's your name? Jeff Taylor. Jeff Taylor. Wait, mine was going like this. Oh. <laughs> That's how families work, really stinks, doesn't it? <laughs> All right, blast off pack, third and final one, I believe. 25. 25, how about 30? 30. How about 35? 40, anybody give me $40? All right, $35, going once, twice, sold. Rick Hackney. How much? 35. Thank you. What do we got next, Anna? Okay, we got another Estes shuttle. We're on lot number 107. Estes shuttle, dark energy. 15. How about 20? $15. How about 20? I need $20. 20 bucks. How about 25? 25? 22? 20. I got 20. All right. 21. 21? How about 22? He wants 22. 23. 23. How about 24? 23 bucks. Going once. Going twice. Sold. 23 bucks. To whom? Parachute on the table. Are you on the parachute? Okay. Parachutes. Anybody know the story on lot 125? It is a couple of oh, parachutes. It's a couple of parachutes. We have a 27-inch homemade parachute. Um, they're both 27. Nicely, they're both 27. Oh, they're both 27. Yeah, they're both nicely sewn. Um, nicely sewn. Uh, this is a Vanderbilt. Oh, this is a Nancy Vanderbilt thing, so I can talk about it then. Nancy's pretty sharp on the parachutes. 
Uh, she doesn't do the outer border, but she does some stitching around the outer border to keep it from coming unraveled. Uh, but very nice parachutes. Nancy's been making these for years. Can I get 10 bucks for a couple of 27 inch parachutes? 10 bucks. How about 15? How about 20? It's worth 20. 20? How about 25? 20 bucks? 25? 22. 22. 20 bucks. Going once. Nice parachutes. Going twice. Sold. We've got an SS space shuttle and a uh, V2. All right, let's go look at five on the space shuttle. I'd like 20 bucks. Look here. 20 bucks, how much? You can do 20 bucks for both. <laughs> See, Marty's the only one in the room who has built this rocket. And it's surprised at you guys. Okay, what number? It is number 101. 40 bucks. 40 bucks. 20 bucks. Okay, 25 for the two. 25. 25? How about 30? 25 going once. Going twice. 25. 27. $27. 28, Carol? 28. 29, Marty? 29. 29 to Marty. 30 to Marty. Who's going to take it away from Marty? $30. 31 bucks. 31 bucks. Okay, how about 32? Marty, 32. No? 31 bucks. Going once, going twice. Sold. We've got a Bell X category 144. It's a plastic bottle. It is open. Um, if you love Micromax motors, it's convertible. <laughs> If you cluster up. <laughs> There's not even room for clusters. I hate to say it. Two dollars, Marty. I want two dollars. You give me two dollars? No, you give me two dollars? Okay. Anybody give me three? Janet will give me three. Okay, there we go. Now we got about four dollars, Marty. Four dollars. No, four dollars to you. You want to buy it for four dollars? You can buy it for four. Is Emmett going five? And it's going five. Will you go six? Yes. Well, seven. Seven. And will you go eight? You're going to go eight. You'll go ten. Marty, you're going to give it up or you're going to go eleven? <laughs> <laughs> That's a picture from Danville in 1992, 25 years ago. You're looking at the Estes R&D department on that picture. Really? Back that, then? That's John Warren from 25 Tell years me. ago. No. Oh. Now you have him. No. Yes. John, call me a bit on this. <laughs> All right. Here we go. Uh, ten dollars. Got a casing here. Come on, ten dollars. Somebody give me ten dollars for a casing. Fifteen. Twenty. Twenty. How about twenty-five? What's the casing? The casing's at eight. In eighteen twenty. And the motors to go in it. Those motors have the rare copper heads in them. Um, <laughs> uh, it has to be because they look old enough. I can't tell, but it looks like it. Um, where am I at? Twenty. Twenty-five. Who give me twenty-five? Did you see? Twenty-five bucks. Twenty-five here with Steve. How about thirty? Anybody give me 30? Come on, a John Horn pitcher and some motors. 
Okay, how about 30? Anybody give me 30? $25 going once, going twice, stole. Steve Humphreys, 35. Okay, Amanda, what is this? This is a, it's a cup holder. And it's got Marvin Martian on that. Very cute. Two dollars. Anybody give me two bucks? Two bucks. Two bucks. Come on, guys. Two bucks. Roger, give me two. Give me three. Three dollars. Marvin Martian. Little cup holder. Three bucks. You have to hand a cup to be good. Okay, two bucks going once. Going twice. So, Roger Wolfong, number 19. Okay, we got some motors. We have D12 sixes and D12 zeros. D12 and let me six. check, hang on. E, I'm sorry, E12 sixes and E12 zeros. And it's 11, 15. And 6, 15, 12. So these are good motors. These are not the ones that explode. Well, <laughs> these are not the ones that normally explode. These are the good ones. I'd like $5. Okay, how about 10? Why don't you guys give me 10 bucks? Where's 10? Okay, how about 15? I'd like $15. The explodes, just made 12, 12 is good. 13 is better. How about 14? 14? 14. 15. 15. 16? 15. Dave's going to take them for 15. 16? Dave, 17? 18? 20 bucks. Okay, Alan Stoker, 20 bucks. There you go, sir. 43 and 44. Okay, what do you want to do next, Amanda? Okay. Mystery box. Amanda says it's okay to do mystery box. This is mystery box number seven. From Estes. We're going to shake it, Amanda? No. It's right there. 25. Oh, thank you. Thank you. 25. How about 30? Come on, we got 30. Yeah, kids. We got 30. kids to take care of. 30. 30 bucks. How about 35? 35. 40? 40. 40 bucks. 45? 30 bucks. 40, 45. 50 bucks. I'd like 50 bucks for that. Love 50 bucks for that. Steve will buy it for 50. 55? Dave, 55. No? $50? It's 55. Okay, how about 60? I'd like $60 for it. Going once. Going twice. Sold! $55. Thank you. He's a mess. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Beavers. Thank you. Who said something about Air 22 earlier? Uh, <coughs> Fascinating to remember. No! <laughs> Narm 22 from 1980. Secret. This must be Tom Secret. Who, who gave this? It was by the stock bag. Okay, uh, this is lot 126, and we're going to go for 10 bucks. Narm 22, the most famous Narm ever in Michigan. Oh, <laughs> 22, $10. Okay, 15. Relive 15 bucks. I'll give it 15 bucks. How about 20? John, 20 bucks. 20 bucks. It's, there is, there's a patch in here. I promise I'll 20 bucks. 20 bucks. Okay. Anybody give me 25? 20 bucks, going once, going twice. Roger, you want $25 for an Air 52 packet? No? I'll give you 25. Will you go 30? I got a daughter starting college. <laughs> 30 bucks. 30 bucks or it's mine? I'll do 27. <laughs> I gotta keep it on the. Oh, I'm in college. I got a kid in college too. <laughs> I got two more after her. Okay, I'll do 28. You're gonna do 29? Mine. You're gonna do 29. You're gonna make me do 30 dollars. He's gonna get two more dollars out of me. I'm giving 30. We pay 31. Oh my God. 31 dollars. 31 dollars. You just bought it for 31 dollars. You got me slick. You got me so.
My section infamously hosted this. Six kids and one adult hosted in there. Yeah. So you wonder why it was a disaster. <laughs> All right, we've got a contestant packet courtesy of Century. I cannot tell what year it was. Does anybody recognize it? I just looked through that and there's nothing in there. There's nothing indicating what it is, huh? It, well, then let's open it up real quick. We're running out of time, so. Oh, Century sent uh, stationery. Authorized personnel. Put that on your check-in for uh, air flying. Century model club guy. Boy, there's just no indication, is there? Oh. Anybody know what year that poster is? Seventy-two. Oh, yeah. Is it? No. Later. That's in Canto Park. <laughs> All right, anybody, anybody give me ten bucks for this? Yeah, you give me twenty for that. You give me twenty for that. Okay, twenty dollars. Anybody give me twenty-two? Going once. Going twice. Sold. Steve Crystal. Twenty-two bucks. This has got the Thunder Rock we just released on there. Very nice. Uh, the patch was taken out. The patch. There was one. There was. I've got one. Twenty bucks. Thirty. How about thirty bucks? Got a magic box for thirty. Where'd Gary go? Yellow. Gary's missing. We got thirty over here. We got thirty dollars. How about thirty-five dollars? Forty. How about forty-five dollars? Fifty? Forty-five. How about fifty? Somebody give me fifty bucks. How about fifty-five? Fifty-five bucks. Fifty-five. Fifty bucks. Fifty-five. Sixty dollars, Steve? Yeah. Okay, sixty-five. Buzz? Sixty-five. You guys, keep going. You know you guys are just going to give them to the same kids anyway. Sixty-five. Is that where we're Buzz? I can't remember. Sixty-five? Sixty, right? We are sixty, right? Sixty. Sixty dollars going once, going twice, sold. Steve Crystal for sixty dollars. Number nine. Okay, more Star Trek stuff. Um, now, none of these boxes are open, so I don't intend to open them. Um, this is a Star Trek VI Undiscovered Country. Tanker. What the heck is a tanker? It's like a sky. Well, you drink beer out of it. Okay. I'm open it. It is open? Yeah. This is open? Okay. Um, 59. Yeah, it's a beer mug. <laughs> no, it's a Don't go along. It's, it's actually for uh, a. Okay, it's got the Enterprise on it. I'd like 10 bucks. It's for blood wine. 10 bucks. <laughs> for blood wine. 10 bucks. Okay, 5 bucks. Somebody give me $5 for this. $5. We got Bob with 5. 10? We do 10. Okay, 10 bucks. How about 12? Anybody give me 12? Yeah. 10 bucks. Going once, going twice, sold, 10 bucks. What's your name? Don Kennedy. Don Kennedy, 10 bucks. Let's have her in Sure, her in front of No? Okay. All right, I know what it is. 146 is our next one. Okay. Yeah, what's the number? Uh, it's the first day of issue, uh, Cape Canaveral, February 20th, 1962. Gemini Project, it's a four cent postcard. Frame, beautiful little item. See, we got good stuff here. All right, can I get five dollars for the postcard? All right, it started at four cents. Can I get a dollar? Can I get a dollar? Five dollars, good man. Six dollars. Six dollars. 
six dollars. I'm looking for six dollars. Okay, six dollars. Steve, six. Six dollars. Oh come on, who did I get this to five for five? This was five dollars. Who had it? Oh, Bob had. Okay, anybody? Anybody else go for six dollars? All right, five dollars, Bob. Bob Justice. Okay, we got another beer mug. It's uh, Starship Editor, Star Trek Enterprise. Five dollars. Five dollars. Anybody give me ten? It's competition certified for beer mugs. <laughs> uh, 1993 is the date on it. I got five dollars to Roger. Six dollars, anybody? Six. Going okay. Six dollars. Seven, Roger. Yeah. Seven bucks. Eight, Bob. <laughs> Seven bucks, Roger. Going once, going twice. Sold. What number is it? In number 60, six zero. All right. Vernon and Clea have signed again another model rocket news. This one is spring of 1990. Um, ooh, it's two color. Red and blue. Three color. That makes it white. White doesn't count. You don't print white. All right. All right. Five dollars. Come on. Five dollars. Five ten. Ten. How about fifteen? Fifteen. How about twenty? I'd like twenty dollars. Fifteen dollars to Steve. Going once, twice. Sold. Fifteen dollars. Oh, I'm sorry. It is number one sixteen. Thank you. Now we are doing one fifteen. Again, uh, Estes Educators News. Bernie and Glita have both signed it. It's got a, um, oh, what is that? Patriot on the cover. This is um, two color, <laughs> yellow and black. <laughs> Does it? Turn the page. Yeah. Oh, right there. Yep. There you go. The guy we're doing, we're, we named this whole thing after. Um, I'd like five dollars for this. Come on, five dollars. How about ten? Ten dollars, anybody? Five dollars going once, going twice. Sold. Lot one fifteen. Bob Justice. Oh, is that? I needed that the other day. We need to have that put in the scale room before. <laughs> We were ready to do that? Yep, yep. Um, quite often at NARAMs and other events, we, uh, we buy printers to do interesting things like print brochures and name badges, etc. Anyway, it's pretty much a brand new printer. It does have a new ink cartridge in it. Uh, I'd like $5 for this. Anybody give me 5 bucks? How about 15 I'd love 15 Is it English or what is that? It is an HP uh, desk jet, and uh, it does not look like it's two-sided. It looks like it's one-sided. Do they have a scanner? Um, no. no, it's just a color inkjet printer. It doesn't look like there's a scanner. Print scan copy, I'm sorry. It's also wireless. It's an all-in-one. Yeah. It's an all-in-one. These are nice. Okay, where, where are we at? We're at ten dollars. He's gonna take it home for ten dollars. Who's gonna give me fifteen? How about twenty? Twenty dollars for a nice printer. Twenty bucks? How about twenty-five? Twenty-five? Twenty. Anybody give me thirty? Twenty-five. Anybody give me twenty-five? Twenty. We're twenty over here. You got twenty-five? Twenty-five over here. You want it for thirty? Twenty-five dollars. Going once, twice. Printer has been sold. Uh, launch magazines. Is this a number? Is there a number to this? Who's a collector of launch magazines? It looks like just about every one of them. Except the, oh, including the beginning edition that was signed by Vern. And this is the mailed edition. There's two editions of the first. But anyway, anybody give me $5 for the bunch? Awesome magazines. Five dollars? How about ten? Ten? How about fifteen? 
Chris, thank you, Chris. 15, 20, anybody? 20 bucks, 25, can I get 25? Can I get 30, can I get 25? 20 bucks to Steve Crystal, going once, twice, sold. A magic box for Vestas. It is number eight. Gone for twenty dollars. Anybody give me twenty-four dollars, twenty forty dollars, forty dollars. I'd like forty-five dollars. Anyone? Fifty bucks. How about fifty-five? It's the last one. Fifty-five bucks. It is the last one, right, Amanda? Sixty. Yes, it is the last one. Sixty dollars, right? Anybody go for sixty-five? How about seventy? Seventy-five. Last box. Eighty dollars. Seventy-five to Buzz. Going once. Twice, soul. <laughs> All right, Amanda, what do we got next? Let's do this big box. This big box is from Balsa Mills. Open it up. Open it up. Really? I can't open it up? I can't. I can't have a knife. You big a knife? Many bad nose cones, so we. That's some fighting words there. <laughs> Bill knows. Okay. Come on. You can't be the only two nose cone makers in the world and not have the same problem. Brandy's gonna buy them anyway. <laughs> That's exactly what it is. Holy crap. <laughs> <laughs> the smell of balsam was in the morning. Is balsam a good condiment to you too? It's everywhere. <laughs> All right. Um, Wow. <laughs> Can I get 40 bucks for this? We got 50 right here. How about 60? 60. 70? 75. I want 80. Looking for 80. $80. $80. I like 85. 100. $90. 100. 100. How about 110? I'm looking for 110. 110. How about 120? I'm looking for $120. $120. Look at all of these. What's the approximate retail value of that, Bill? $120. I'm looking for $120. Hey, Bill. Come on, I don't want to let this go for just $110. Bill, what's the approximate retail value of that? $110. Bucks. That's a lot of nose cones. 120 bucks. Lord of the Rings. 120 bucks. 115 going once. Nobody wants to give me 120. 120? One, we got 115. Look for 120. Yep. I'm looking for 120. How about 125? 120 bucks. Hundred twenty-five. Hundred twenty-two. Hundred twenty-five. He's a wily kind of idiot. Yeah. One twenty-five. Well played, sir. One twenty-five. No. One twenty-two. Going once. One twenty-five. One twenty-five. How about one thirty? One thirty. I gotta have one thirty. It can leave the room at one thirty. One thirty, hundred and thirty dollars. Hey Brian, how you doing? <laughs> Did not fall. <laughs> he knows better. He knows better. Hundred and thirty dollars. He's too smart to laugh. One thirty. Hey, I want one thirty-five. One thirty-five. 
135. You said I could leave on 130. You said 130. Yeah, deal's done. 130. Come on. Can I get you 135? I would not do that. You said he could have 130. There's 130. We got to honor that. All right. Thank you, Bill. Um, Amanda, do you want to go here or where do you want to go next? That's a lot of rockets, Somebody Rick. Somebody give me the time. I don't have a clue. It's 10 o'clock. 10 o'clock. Oh, way over. Let's do these. Let's do these. Let's do these. We, we've got four goblets as a set. They are number 70, 72, 73. Do them all together. 75. Do more. 74 and 71 as well. All right, Amanda wants to put them all in. All right, they're all Lord of the Rings collection. Lord of the Rings collection, it looks like the whole thing. These mugs are extremely heavy duty, very nice mugs. And I would like $20 for the set. They're actually pretty nice, I have a set of these. $20 for the set. Anybody go? 20? How about 15 I'd like $15 for the set. There's six of them. If you have a family larger than that, tell them. <laughs> we got a bid here? 15. 15. Awesome. 20 bucks. I'd love 20 bucks out of these. 20 bucks. $15. Going once. Going twice. Sold. $15. Nice. Right here. Did you get all the numbers for the Sorry. Let's see if there's 75. 71 70, through 75. Sorry, 70 through 75. 70 through 75. 15 dollars for all of us? 15 dollars. Good deal. That's the whole new one. All right, we got two flutter buys and a bulk pack Viking. I'd like a buck. Somebody give me a buck? Three. Three dollars. How about four? Three dollars going once. Ten if you will. Ten dollars right up here. Ah, you got a nail in the mark. I'll tap the nail in the mark. Ten dollars. Anybody give me twelve dollars? I'll deliver it in person for you. Twelve dollars. <laughs> Ten dollars going once, twice. Sold. Uh, Bob bought ten dollars. Lot number thirty-one. Uh, we've got some books. Uh, official art of 2010, lot number 25. Uh, we've also got Battlestar Galactica. Uh, what's that? That's Cattle Car Galactica. <laughs> Close Encounters, Star Chaser, More Battlestar Galactica Blueprints, and Doom. Whoops, I missed one. Yep, that's it. Five dollars. Anybody give me five bucks for this? Yeah, I will. Oh, that's a separate one. Okay, we're throwing 24 and 25 together. They're all kind of related. I like five dollars for the set. I'll do five. How about ten? If they give me ten, how about six? I'll give it ten. You go fifteen. All right, ten dollars. Anybody give me eleven? Ten dollars going once, twice, sold. Uh, lot twenty-four and twenty-five for Bodeway. I'll give you five for the Starfighter. For which one? Just the Starfighter. We'll talk. <laughs> what are we on next? All right. This is lot 32. It is Flutterbys, three of them. Anybody give me a buck? Six. Six dollars. Going once, going twice. Sold. Sold. Six dollars. You got to say a lot of Lot 32. Uh, anybody in here use a little light? Yeah. 
Lumalite, this is, uh, which one is it here? This is the super foam, so it's great for nose cones and filling between fins and stuff like that. Uh, I don't know, this stuff goes for about, what, 30, 40 bucks? And uh, model aviation magazines. Just a bunch of magazines and stuff. <laughs> What is the Century Catalog? No. Uh, model Airplane Magazine. Parachute Making Guide. Quest History of Space Flight. More Quest Magazines. Extreme Rocketry Magazine. Haley's Comet Issue. Airmen. A couple of Discover Magazines. Five dollars. Five bucks. This is lot one one zero. Anybody give me five bucks for it? Come on, somebody give me five bucks. John gives me five. Anybody give me six? John Stenberg, five bucks. Thank you for taking it. All right, we've got a book set number five, Moonport, USA. A 1995 uh, Estes catalog. 1975. Handbook of Model Rock Tree. And this is the. Uh, this one's the revised fifth edition. I don't remember it being in that cover, but okay, it's here. <laughs> and what number is that? Five. And a the Kennedy Space Center story. And this. Was published in. Up and down. Time in the back corner. Anybody want to go 15? Okay. Okay. Oh, come on. Go 15. 15. Okay. okay, 10. Who was 10? All right, Alan Stoker. Going once, right, twice, three times. Okay. Okay. Sold. Okay. Sold. Okay. Cheers, Alan. Right. Okay. 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 How much? 15. Okay. 10. 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 All right, we've got another set of Star Trek dishes. Uh, the same set that was before the Enterprise. Except the clumping in there. This is, is group 55. Can I get $20 for it? The original price on this thing, oh, it's not on this one, it's 129 bucks. what they normally go for. Yep, three-piece set. The uh, saucer, the cup, and the, the dinner plate. 20 bucks. Bob Trust has got it. Anybody want to give me 25? I am your China. Oh. Going once, keep, keep, going keep, twice. Keep, 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 keep. So, Bob Justice, First, lot 55. Got that, Tom? Got it, thank you. Never makes up a nerd. All right, 23. This is a Star Trek First Contact Magnet. And a whole bunch of other Star Trek stuff, like uh, the Space Flight chrono Chronology. Yeah, that one. The official blueprints of the, the Enterprise. Star Trek uh, Compendium. Compendium. Star Trek The Lost Years. And where no one has gone before, a history in pictures. So for those of you that can't read, <laughs> lots of pictures. I should buy that for my staff. I mean, uh, then we've also got the Star Trek Starfleet Technical Manual. Fully illustrated, it says. Uh, all kinds of different illustrations of all kinds of different machines and, and weapons and uniforms. I'd like to start this at $10. Anybody a Star Trek fan willing to part with 10 bucks? I'll give you 10 bucks. Okay, how about 15? Love to take 15. All right, 10 bucks. Going. Perfect, how about 15 now? $12 going once. 15, how about, will you do 20? 16, that's good, 17? 17. How about go 18? Okay, $17. Going once? 20. 20. Who went 20? Bob? Oh, okay, 20. 20 going once, going twice, 
So the magnets are pretty cool. I'm sorry. <laughs> For how much? I can't no, see. Just don't get them Twenty dollars to gaffers. No, just get. Don't let the magnets hear you. They could assimilate you. Well, they are. Uh, we're not going to do the wrong. Oh, it's a little red. Okay, these are all the same color, right? Yeah, just do the other. All right. Um, these are coffee mugs. I believe it's this particular mug. There's six of them. These are different than the tea cups that you got in your sets. Uh, and they went. Uh, I've got a set of six. No, uh, we've got five. Five that are the same and one separate. Oh, that's oh, kind of Uh oh. Five of them are Star Trek six. The other one is USS Excelsior. Minus fifty cents. Very good. Thank you for bringing that. This is USS Excelsior. There's a single mug. The others are um, Star Trek six. I would like to take. Which just means that Zulu will drink from it, not Kirk. Right? I'd like $10 to start. And it's not even the things I like. Bob, I'd like $10 to start. Hey, baby, give me 12 15 15 20 bucks. 25 anybody. 20 bucks going once. Twice. So. Top Justice, 20 bucks. Tammy got the numbers? Yes. That was all six of them? Uh, all six of them. Yes, thank you. Five, five six, I don't know. I I've got a book on spacecraft, Starliners, uh, Great Space Battles, and Shipwreck. Space Rack. Space Rack. Space Rack. No. Five bucks. Give me ten, somebody. Somebody give me ten bucks for the set. Okay, lot 21 is going for five bucks. Going once, twice, sold. What in fire? Mr. Johnson. Got that one? Johnson. Alright, got a new one. Okay. How much was it? Five. $5. All right, we've got the Space Shuttle Operations Manual. Obsolete. Written by a former Army member. Is it really? Okay, I've got an operations manual. Can somebody give me a buck? Oh, come on. One buck. One buck. I got the handbook, three volume set. Okay, one buck. Anybody else give me more in a buck? Two bucks. <laughs> Come on, Bob Justice, a dollar and a lot of 46. You it. Hmm? It would have been worth 10 had you not said that. <laughs> Rocketry <laughs> 2, the latest edition, I believe. Yes. Uh, it is lot 111. Um, ten bucks. If they give me ten bucks for the for the book, it's worth uh, thirty-two fifty. Give me five. That's good. Give me ten, somebody. Ten bucks. Come on, we need ten bucks. Five dollars. Going in one. Yeah. Going once. Twice. Number was one one one. And it's sold. Five dollars. Topics in advanced rocketry. Three, three MIT thesis. Is that the Mandelbo? Yeah. 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 It's in hardcover. Anybody give me five bucks? And it's got the correction sheet in it. Yeah, it did have a sheet in it somewhere. Okay, five bucks I got. How about ten? Anybody give me ten? Ten bucks over here. Anybody give me fifteen? Likes to get fifteen on the book? Fifteen. Fifteen, very good. Good man. Twenty bucks. Twenty bucks? How about twenty-five? Twenty-five? Anybody twenty-five? Twenty dollars going once. Last time we had that in paperback, it was uh, fifty-five dollars. In paperback. In paperback. Yep. Yeah. 
Yep. 20 bucks. Going once. Yeah. 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 25. Bitters up here. Bitters up here. Thrilling <laughs> 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 me back. Manta's good at that too. Okay, 25 bucks. Anybody give me 30? Steve, 30. 30. How about 35? Sure. Okay, 40? Yeah, I'll do it. Okay, how about 45? <laughs> 45. Oh, I think I can get him up for a while. <laughs> 45. 45. 50, Steve? No, I'll stop. Okay, you're going to stop. Burn! <laughs> Roasted! <laughs> you want twice? I'll do 50. Yeah, I knew you would. I was going to wait until I could get closer to 50 bucks. 55. I think he was bluffing. I think he was trying to scare me off. <laughs> I'll stop. <laughs> Third devil for us. 55. Going once. Going wow, twice. So. Yeah. All right, guys. All right, guys. That's a happy deal. Okay, I would have done 100 bucks. Yeah. This is. Oh, if that's what it is. I'm going to allow you to start with the hug. These are. Yeah, you're right. These are. They are. Okay. They are the right ones. Yeah. Hey, oh, Gary Beats yeah, is playing with you. Yeah. Uh, okay. Good. We'll see you know if we'll say this. We both want whatever you were rocking. Woo! 90 and 86. There's a set of four of these. We have a set of four drinking glasses, USS Enterprise. How about 10? You need to set those so you lay down. About 10. Which enterprise? Uh, this is USS Enterprise uh, 1701A. There's four Six. of them. <laughs> is that a four? There's a set of four. There's a set of four. Yeah. Um, Amanda needs glasses in her apartment, so it's 12. Can we go 20? Yeah, can we go 20? You do 20, I'll, let, I'll consider letting it go. 20 bucks? 20. 20? All right, 25? 25? No? No? 20 bucks. Going once? Wait, go 25. Going twice? Will you go 30 towns? Going once, going twice, sold 30 bucks. You cost Tom 10 bucks just because you don't have enough glasses in your house. I don't have enough silver either, but there's not no I have some Galapagos from the Lord of the Rings. <laughs> <laughs> we have tons of wine left. Get your kids to All right, we've got a, another class wet wear set. Oh, we got two things over there. Oh, let's this is the tall version of the Enterprise, oh same gosh. series. <laughs> who bought that? Who bought those glasses? <laughs> Tom, twenty bucks. <laughs> same. That's the tall version. Oh, oh, oh. Fifty-seven. Ten dollars. Yeah. Ten. We have a guest house. Twelve. How about fifteen? Anybody go fifteen bucks? Set of four glasses. Manda needs glasses. Fifteen. Fifteen. 20. 20. Anybody want to go 25? 25 bucks. Where were we at? At Bob? $20 going once. Going twice. Bob has got a whole collection of uh, glasses. All right. And my wife thought she could buy dishes. <laughs> Divorce all the way. <laughs> okay, model rocket news. This is lot 118. Vernon Glita signed it. It's got the space shuttle on the front. This is winter 1987. Um, two color, green and black. Has it got its coupons in it? The coupons are gone. No, there were, there were no coupons at this time. The order blank is in there. Let's see if it's buy one, get something free. Uh, no, it's not. Anyway, two bucks. Anybody give me seven? I'd love seven dollars. Five dollars. Yes. Going once. Seven. Seven. Eight dollars, anybody? Ten. Ten. Twelve. Ten dollars. Going once. Going twice. Sold. Ten dollars. Uh, it's lot 118. It's for Dave. 
All right, here's the last signed item. You know, Vernon and Lita are gone, but... Yeah, they went up to the room, but let's not lose, lose, a chance, lose a chance to get something signed from them. This is lot 152. It's a 2001 catalog, Estes Cox. Was this the only catalog they did this year? Anybody know? 2001? I know it was a long time ago. I'd like to start the bid at two bucks. Two bucks? Come on, somebody's got to have a Vernon Glita Estes catalog for two bucks. How about five bucks? How about ten? Come on, I've got to have ten. I'll take it for ten. I'll take it for ten. Anybody give me twelve? Twelve bucks. All right, both ways are going to take it for ten. Is that your stack? I said. Number six. This is lot six. It is the science fiction book, Star Quest, Space Portal. Patrol. Patrol. Portal. Okay, Space Patrol. <laughs> Worlds at War. Space Traveler's Handbook. And. Settlers in space. Wow. All right, uh, I'd like five dollars for the set. Anybody give me five bucks? We've only got like four items left, so if you haven't had a chance to get anything, now's the time. Um, this book's falling apart a little bit, but it's got some interesting. There's six books photos. here, so how about we start at six? Yeah. Buck a piece. Buck a piece. Sounds good. Buck a piece. Six bucks. Seven. I like seven. Come on, this is it. We've got only like five items to go, gang. Seven bucks? Six bucks. Go on seven. Seven. Good move. Eight dollars, anybody? Seven dollars. Going once. Going twice. Sold. Seven dollars to Mr. Johnson. Oh, All right, what do we got, Amanda? We've got a collection of Peterson's books of Man in Space, and this is number 20. And they all have the chronology. This one here has Apollo 1 through 6, 7 through 11, 12 through 17. All right, can I get five bucks out of the set? How about 10? Love to have 10 bucks. How about 15? Fifteen. Fifteen dollars. Come on, I gotta have fifteen dollars. All right, ten dollars. Going once. Going twice. Sold. Ten dollars. Congratulations, Mr. Tom. Is that Tom Beach? That one. Tom Beach. Thanks, Tom. Uh, ba, 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 ba. We're doing 49. Planets without pilots. Oh, planes without pilots. Catalog of science fiction hardware. I gotta look at this. All right, science fiction hardware. There's, there's, there's plans in here. Oh my gosh. We could build something in here. Man on the moon with their big pictorial, pictorial stuff. These are great pictures to throw on the wall. Uh, what's up there? What's up there? Oh, this is a great elementary uh, story on all the six planets that were known at the time. Okay. <laughs> I'd love five dollars for that. Come on, a chunk goes worth five bucks. Five dollars. How about six? Six. Come on, seven. Let's get some excitement going. Ten. Ten dollars. Oh my gosh, we're all the way up to ten dollars. How about eleven? Eleven bucks for some books. Ten dollars. Going once. Going twice. So, Bob Justice gets ten dollars worth of books. What do we got? Yeah, hundred dollars worth of books for ten dollars. We have Civil Airliners since 1946. World Aircraft. So probably expires uh, somewhere in here. What the uh, early James? What is this the property of a public library? Since, oh, since 1946. Yeah, what number is that? 48. This is number 48, and it was printed in 1969, so there's got to be at least 10, 
Ten airliners in here. Another book's over here going with that as well. Oh, this goes with this? Okay. Yes. Well, I was wondering where those went with. Jeff, I found a, a um, silent option that you want that we're not going to German secret weapons, blueprints for Mars. Uh, countdown for tomorrow and 30 airplanes for the paper pilot. Okay, six dollars? Yes. Yes, and they give me seven. Seven, Emmett? Seven dollars. <laughs> and they give me eight. Okay, seven dollars to Emmett. Yeah, going, woo -hoo, going woo -hoo. once, yeah. twice. Emmett. So Emmett, you can sell that. One book for seven dollars to that guy right there. <laughs> but that's the only one. So yeah. But that's okay. You want to be her playing on the bottom. Uh, the National Air and Space Museum. You've got to be kidding. Yeah, really. No, so, you got the whole museum. There is a museum called. Well, hey, this is all historical. None of this stuff still where it was. So, this is a historical book now. Okay, the Encyclopedia of Space. And Quest for Space. I think I have this one in my office. All right, anyway, some nice books. Five dollars. How about 20? Anybody give me 20 bucks for some books? Fifteen dollars. Going once. Going twice. So, Bob Justice. She likes twice. This, this is it. Uh, space station. The next logical step. This was during the space shuttle age. Uh, Soviet spacecraft. The encyclopedia of Soviet spacecraft. And it's got the brand. And it's got all kinds of Sputnik. Uh, and uh, it looks like their uh, their space station mirror. What, yeah, what, theirs was mirror, right? Yeah. Mirror. And then uh, space wars, uh, worlds and weapons, space weapons. Wow, there's some good old stuff here. Some great science fiction. Exactly. There might even be a few models you can model in here. Five dollars. It's the last item we got. Ten dollars. How about fifteen? Ten dollars. Going once. Going twice. Soul. Bob Justice. Ten dollars. Did we get a lot number on that one? No. Forty-five. Forty-five. Thank you, Amanda. Thank you. We have three boxes of motors up here. If you're interested, come see us. Otherwise, they're going to the next auction. Marie, do we want to? Maria, do we want to um, tell the winners who got the silent auction? Um, yes. <laughs> you Thank you killed very much, it, folks. We will put the controls for what we earned. What we raised. What we raised. I can't believe one of those still exists. Well, I only made like a dozen of those. So. James Johnson won the SD's SLB Dark Energy. Ed Chess won a Nike X and Dark Energy. Dave Lucas won the Super Foam and Miscellaneous stuff. Uh, Dave Lucas won the X15. Maria Ha won the two Flutterbys. <laughs> Bar only two? I can't read that. Chumka? Krumka won the three Dark Energy Bundle. And Jennifer Ash won the Executioner and Dark Energy Bundle. Yeah, you're going to 